So here we are uh, on how to fill in the PDF that you've downloaded to your phone. So you go through here, like there, you fill in and choose whichever your business is. And these ones need to be filled in as well. Don't leave them out uh, empty like that. So I'm going to fill in, then I'm going to show you how you save it so that it is a document that we are able to work with. So let's say mine is a B2C. I click there, B2C, choose a website building um, service. Maybe I'm going to use Wix. So let me write Wix there. Name of the shop, it's somewhere online. Okay. And then select an e-commerce template with the color, what, what do you sell, and the sales policy, and all that. So customization. I will select a template of business coaching. So you write whatever you are going to do. And my colors are yellow, blue, and white. Okay. So there is the form. I go to the next one. List two or list two or three of your products and services. Okay, so I've got content creation, content creation, video, visibility, um, one on one coaching. Okay, so you fill the rest of the form, right? And then how do you save it here on a um, on a phone? So you go to those three dots up there, right? And then you say save as, okay? So you can say save as. And then the location, where are you saving this file to? WPS Cloud, Add Cloud, Location. So I want to save it to where? To my phone, right? So this is how I save it, task, task three, com, completed, then save. So it is saving on my document, it has saved on my document, right? So I go to files, then I go to, um, can I find it on docs? Task three, that's just the task three that is there but I want to find the one that I filled in. So you go to the phone and then you go to your documents. You are looking for your documents. So you should see where you saved your file. Then I find there is my task three completed, right? There is the one that we are talking about. Okay. Then I open it to confirm that really it, uh, it was filled in. All right. So unselect my phone usually does that. So can you see that it is filled in because I saved it? All right. So what do I do now? I have to go to my website and upload it. Okay. Here we are on the website. Then click there where it says add submission. So I click where it says add submission. And then I have to put it here upload a file okay so i choose where it was selected it's where remember where you saved your files so i have to look for it on my so it's on the documents remember my task three can you see my file where i saved it there so then i click there that's a file that i'm choosing then i upload then save changes it has uploaded my file and then i need to go back and see that now on my task three is it showing me that i have uploaded my task 
So if you see, it will show me that it says what? It says done. It means that I have submitted fully. And then it shows me that it's now 100%. Okay. So I hope this is clear and that you are able to now submit and do it on the phone.